All right, so Tamara, tell me what's different from the beginning? Um, so it, only, it takes extreme stressful situations for her to start that behavior again. Um, what types of behaviors are you talking about? So like the, the flopping on the floor um, and uh, like she would get into people's faces, oh man, and just like <laughs> really literally just making noises, um, getting in their faces and she doesn't do any of that stuff anymore. Um, That's awesome. I feel like she's growing, her emotional age is growing, uh, she was stuck. Uh, for a while in between probably 18 months and four years of age emotionally and uh, she's really progressing. I would say we're consistently seeing a nine-year-old now oh, and she is now 11. So, uh, yeah. So, she's yeah. Right. so what are the, some of the things that you've done that you think have got her to that positive place? Well, staying consistent and what I mean by that is one in her routine, you know, so she gets up at the same time every single morning except for on Saturdays. We let the kids sleep in a little bit. She has breakfast right around the same time. Um, you know, having her do a routine, like she brings me her lunchbox and her work folder from school and sets it on the counter and everything. And so we just stay very consistent, but also um, emotionally consistent. So if I can keep myself from my blood pressure rising, I, because there's things that she does that trigger. Um, she attacked me several times in the beginning. And so it, um, the small behaviors that led up to those um, really big emotional outbursts uh, are, became triggers for me. And so if, when I recognize that she has fear behind those triggering behaviors, would, then I recognize that I, my fear response was kicking in. Oop, I just touched the mic. Um, my fear response would kick in. Okay. And so if I can keep my blood pressure, mm -hmm. and so staying consistent in that really helps her to regulate. So, um, things sound like they're continuing to move forward. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What is the next step with Brian Post and his team? I have no idea. Um, I know that he's got to get us through the holidays because holidays are triggers <laughs> for these kids. Right. And uh, we're we like, even just since th Thanksgiving was two weeks ago and um, we're seeing her regress a little bit, but that's pretty normal. And knowing that it's normal helps us to realize that we can Manage get it. through it, you know? Yeah, and just continuing to try to stay consistent and um, regulated in our own emotions and realizing that um, we don't have to become fearful just because she's fearful yeah. and uh, he calls it a negative feedback loop and so um, yeah like kind of managing that yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, can really help if so. you had um, a couple in front of you and they were dealing with challenges mm -hmm. with their child what would you tell them um, to encourage them to work with Brian Post and, and the team? I, I, I've already done it several times. I highly recommend his uh, Post Daily Dose that he does on Facebook, um, and that's through the Post Institute. And um, he is really good that if they can actually private message him or send him an email and let them know if they can't find that behavior like he's addressed before, uh, then he'll address it for them. Wow. And he'll let them know when he's going to be on their lives so that they can type in with questions and everything. And uh, that's been helpful to a couple people that I know just to go on there. And uh, so that would be my first bit of advice. And then to try to get into a, the, a wraparound program, um, I just, you know, I tell him, you have no idea what you're missing out on just because, you know, uh, he, he pro helps provide meals and yeah. um, respite workers come in and uh, housekeeping. Yeah. <laughs> and for some people that is huge, you know, yeah. and so, uh, and I just encourage them, um, you know, if they're eligible for the program, which means you have to have adopted a child in the state of California, um, to give them a call. Yeah. Well, I want to thank, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. You thank were you. awesome. Thank you. Yep. Choose love. Choose love.